Well, we woke up to cloudy skies out there today. A few raindrops, but not a whole lot. Skies did clear this afternoon and temperatures warmed into the 70s in a number of locations, practically Bay Area wide. We briefly hit the 70s in Oakland and Richmond, 72 in Redwood City. It was 77 out in Livermore, 60s closer to the coastline. We're looking live at the San Mateo Bridge right now where you can see the mainly clear skies. It is going to stay clear out there tonight. We're not really going to see a whole lot of fog formation. Temperatures this evening remaining in the upper 50s and low 60s, pretty much Bay Area wide. Tomorrow morning, though, it is going to be chillier than what we we saw today. We'll see a lot of 40s out the door. We're just going to see that clear skies. A few clouds here and there, but uh, we're going to see even more clearing into the afternoon. Warmer temperatures as well. More 70s, so practically Bay Area wide once again will be in the 70s. Here's a look at satellite and radar picture. Skies clearing over the Bay Area. Still seeing a few residual showers through the Sierra, but it's spotty at best. This system continues to move well to the north of us. You can see the tail end of it here now pushing through Nevada and headed towards Arizona. Here's a look at temperatures out the door tomorrow morning. Again, mainly clear skies, so it will be cooler than what we saw last night. The cloud cover kept us a little warmer. 43 in Livermore, 45 in Half Moon Bay, 42 in Santa Rosa, and 40 in Napa to start the day. But temperatures headed up for the afternoon. We'll see those low 70s for the South Bay, 73 in Sunnyvale, San Jose, 72 in Cupertino, 71 for Milpitas. The upper 70s for our inland valleys will hit 77. Again in Livermore, 76 in Pleasanton, 74 in Walnut Creek, low 70s for the East Bay shoreline. We'll hit those 70s very briefly, though, and then drop back into the 60s. 60s also in San Francisco, Berkeley, Oakland, near the coastline. 70s, though, for the North Bay. Here's a look at your extended forecast. Tomorrow, a little bit warmer, but the winds are going to start picking up into the afternoon. In fact, Thursday will be even windier. We could see a red flag warning issued for Thursday. It hasn't been issued yet. And then as we head into the weekend now, it does look like we have a chance of rain into Saturday. Right now, it's just a slight chance of a few light showers. We'll give you the updates as it gets a little closer.